all those monkeys. They showed the need for comfort by rhesus monkeys. A. To find out if baby monkeys would prefer a food source or comfort source and protection. Method. Rhesus monkeys raised in isolation were used. It was a lab experiment. There were two surrogate methods. One made of wire mesh with feeding bottle attached to it. Two made of cloth comfort with no food. Results. The monkey spent majority of the time with the cloth surrogate but moved only to feed with the surrogate to feed. The cloth surrogate gave comfort in new situations. When these monkeys grew up, they showed both social and emotional disturbances. The females were bad mothers and often violent to their offspring. Conclusion Infant monkeys formed attachments with a figure which provided comfort and protection. Growing up in isolation affected the monkey's development. Evaluation Strength It was a lab experiment which meant strict control of variables, so that results were unlikely to be affected by unknown variables, making it more valid. The findings were applied to real life, which led to changes in hospital procedures. Weaknesses The study cannot be generalised to humans due to humans and monkeys being qualitatively different. There were ethical problems. The monkeys were put in stressful situations, later showing psychological damage due to this experiment. The monkeys were also isolated, which means it had low ecological validity, meaning it is not generalisable and has low population validity.